So for today, we're going to be looking at the Festival of the Lost 2022 set, which is the robotic or Gundam or basically mecha themed. And I am happy that I got it because I really wanted to get it for the Titans and Warlocks, not so much the Hunters. I think the Hunters definitely lost out because I, it is the worst one out of all of them. We will be talking about how it looks, how it shaders and my personal thoughts about the armor itself. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe. I do have the 2023 set from the Festival of the Lost, which is the bug themed. And I know spiders are not bugs, but it's just easier to say bugs. And that one, I did the review for the armor already. We look at how it looks, how shaders and everything like how we're going to do this video. And I already have the shader video as well for that video. This video will have the shader video after this one, just so that way you guys can see how the armor looks. And then if you guys are interested to see how uh, shaders with all of the shaders that I currently own, then be looking out for that video. But for this one, we will have shaders. It will just be four, but I will show you how it shaders as well because it is weird. Uh, there's a few pieces where I was not expecting it to shader that way. So again, if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe. I really do appreciate it, especially when you guys comment and just, it really does help the channel grow. So other than that, let's get into it. So to start off, let's go with the Hunters, Titans and the Warlocks. That's how I usually do it. For the hunters, the machine skirmisher is pretty trash. So I am not the biggest fan of the helmet. I get the reference. I just still don't like the helmet. I think the cloak is the only decent part. Well, the cloak and the chest piece are the only decent parts to this. I think the helmet can definitely be utilized in some cool uh, armor sets that I've seen, but the arms and boots are absolutely trash. Um, there's so many things to it. Let me just t like the biggest thing is the asymmetrical uh aspect of the arms and the boots is the biggest portion of why i don't like these but even then it's not the whole portion the fact that like a lot of the armor armor in the boots and the arms are just leather which is so weird considering when you look at the hunters and or the titans and warlocks everything is armored so when i see the hunters i'm just like what happened like why why is there no armor why is there just leather pieces like the like from the waist and all the way to the knee for the right side, it's all leather. And then for the left side, it's just like up, like up on top of the knee. So it's like, dude, there's so much leather in this when this is supposed to be a mecha themed set. I think that's like my biggest annoyance with this is just the fact that like, there's just not enough armor. And that's not even like looking at the fact that it's asymmetrical as hell. Like the, the Titans has an asymmetrical piece, the arms, but I think it's done really well because both of the arms are symmetrical and it's just adding one piece to one of the shoulder pads that makes it asymmetrical. But that's not that big a deal. When you look at the hunters, it's like the shoulder pads are symmetrical, but then the arms doesn't have the other piece on the other side. And again, a lot of leather underneath, which is really weird. Why didn't you guys do it like an exo frame? Like kind of how the warlocks have where it's like underneath, there's not leather. It's just more armor. Overall, I think the hunters like honestly this might be the worst armor set eververse ever has ever sold in my eyes just because there's just no redeeming qualities about it it's supposed to be mecha themed but like half of this armor is leather which is like why <clears throat> and that's not even getting into the asymmetrical the asymmetrical is terrible it looks like they built the left leg and then just took pieces from it same thing with the arms i don't know i <clears throat> hunters definitely got the worst one and I, I hate it because we could have gotten something really, really cool. We could have gotten something Gundam themed and you can see some Gundam <clears throat> aspects to it. The boots have definitely has that Gundam flavor, the chest piece as well. But <clears throat> man, they really fell short with the helmet and everything else. Honestly, let's just get into the Titans mechanized protector, which I actually love. I think this one is so cool. I love the arms. It gives me like Zaku vibes from Gundam, which is super, super cool. I think the chest piece is cool. I think the only piece that's really bad from this whole set is going to be the mark. And the only reason I say that is because when you combine it with other pieces and even with the actual like existing set, it looks way too bulky, at least for females. I don't know how it looks for males, but it looks way too big, almost like it's floating from the side. You'll definitely notice it from the sides. Uh, I think the helmet is super dope. I think the boots are super dope. The only annoyance I have is the fact that the like blue steel that you see on the chest piece and in some of the arms uh, actually takes off colors in a really weird way. So just be aware that those two pieces are going to be the ones that are going to be annoying the most. Other than that, like everything else is super dope. Again, boots. I love 
helmet i love and then the arms is like one of my favorites as well so like titans definitely i think definitely won this just because the warlocks helmet is dope and the arms are dope chess piece is cool and the boots are cool but i just found myself having such a hard time combining it with other pieces that i was like helmet i can combine with pretty much anything and it's gonna look cool boots i wish i had that problem i wish i could do that as well because i do like the boots a lot but the arms is also like i can combine it with everything the only thing i don't like is the mark just because it's or the uh, bond the bond is way too fucking massive but other than that like again titans and warlocks y'all got some dope armor hunters we look like fucking leather hobos like we li we literally look like a kid like it looks like a costume compared to the other ones where it looks like actual gundam or actual like mecha themed stuff and then the hunters like you look like a kid with like leather leather like pants and shirts trying to look mecha and like making stuff out of a box like it looks so bad i would love for bungie to just be like you know what we fucked up and machined skirmisher for the hunters so we're just gonna either remake excuse me we're either gonna remake it or we're gonna fix it because this is by far the worst armor set i think that i can think of in, like from like from right now this is the worst one if there's any other worse ones i'll definitely have them up now but this one's by far the worst for the hunters titans and warlocks i you know i probably should make a worst armor set video for eververse that'd be pretty funny but yeah let me know what you guys think as for how it shaders So as you guys can see the shadering is pretty dope for some of these armor sets just the only negative again like i said is the fact that the titan's arms um shader's really weird now that i really think about it because i didn't mention this but the shoulder pads and the arms take shaders in a really weird way and you guys will notice it when you, just, you start combining it with different shaders it's just that like sometimes it takes the color you want and sometimes it doesn't take the color you want so it's like really weird and the under armor taking the the, the like the blue steel with echo anger that you guys are noticing right now that like off color is the least of my problems when it comes to the shoulder pads because the shoulder pads again take really weird colors so just be aware of that other than that everything takes colors really really well i think the warlocks take colors really well as well the hunters i mean they the colors are fine it's just again the whole armor that just like looks like fucking doo-doo butter but yeah i am pretty happy with what i got for the example sets because again i have already completed all of the individual armor sets for the classes so hunters titans and warlocks i'm gonna be honest with you guys the hunters i had the worst part like worst time with just because i hate that armor with a passion but the titans and warlocks bro that shit came out fire so i will be working on that probably next week you guys will start noticing the individual sets because i still want to continue the exotic videos which again if you haven't seen i started with the warlocks specifically the geomags which i'll have up right now that one we look at how it looks all of the ornaments how it shaders and i give you example sets for each of the ornaments so i'm definitely very confident in those videos just because i do put like i feel like that's what i'm known for now even though i haven't done it in a while like that's what got people to my channel so that's why i want to keep doing it but yeah i appreciate you guys be safe i will see you guys later